Welcome back once again. In this part, we will design our data item for our recycler view. So create a new layout. So we need to create a new layout resource file. And we can call it. I don't know why it takes too much time for creating a new layout. So now we can call it income recycler data. We can use same data item or we can change it later. So open this text and change this constant layout. Change this constant layout and add a linear layout. First, we need to add a card view. Because we want to show all this data inside a card view. And hide wrap content and add a card elevation 5 dp. And Android elevation is going to be, we can call it 5 dp. And now in here we need to add a linear layout. So white mass parent and height wrap content. And we need to add orientation. We can add orientation horizontal or we think okay add a layout margin 5 dp. And inside this linear layout, we need to add relative layout at a white mass parent. Layout weight we should add 0 because we will add layout weight and add layout height wrap content. Now we need to add layout weight. We can add 1 dp, 1 not dp. And for text view, we can add white mass parent and height wrap content. Now, for this text, we can add a text and we can call it 6 July. And this text view is for showing our post data. That's why I would like to add some dummy date and add Android text color and Android and we can choose a color and color we can call it dead color and we can choose this color I think this color is good for showing a date for for that color now open this one and we need to call it color we need to call it what was the name and name was dead color and now we need to add a text appearance Text appearance is going to be text appearance small and a style. We need to add a style, uh, not a style. We need to add, we need to add not text size, we need to add and we can call it text style bold. And we need to define an ID. We can call it dead text income. I think we need to clean this project. 
and uh, copy this relative bond relative layout once more time and uh, paste it here and for this relative layout we need to add layout weight to and uh, change this id first change this text and this one is going to be for our title it's not a title you can show it uh, as our type so just add for a dummy text and we can call it type text income okay change it to type that will be better and copy this text view once more time and paste it here and change this name and this one is going to be note text and in here we need to add layout below and id and our previous text view id was type text income this way it will be at serial by serial so now we can see two text view but if we use linear layout and if we add orientation vertical then it will set automatically but for relative layout it it will not support automatically so we need to add a layout below and then call our previous text view id it's take too much time for gradle build and inside this card view we need to add layout margin 5 dp this way maybe we will be able to see clear card view still it's get all build running we need to wait till that and pause this video think okay now i think all good so now we can see our all this data and change this text type to description for our description and instead of this dead color we need to add color black so add android color text color android color black and for description we don't need text style bold and it's not a description it's was a uh, note and change this text color and we need to add android color and a text color and this color is going to be android color block and we need to remove this and so we add different id so type text income and type text income and now copy this relative layout once more time and paste it here and for this relative layout we will show here our total amount so now change this id and we can call it amount text income you can uh, you can you can choose your own layout if you want to show data different type so i just want to retrieve all this data this way that's why i am i am doing this design and add a text for example at some dummy amount just for example okay so we so so we successfully design our this part now open this type text and add maximum line one because we want to show only one line in here when we will click details then we will show full data so and for description for note we need to add maximum line one this way we can show only one line we don't need to add all this data in this item view so now close this and close this color and now create one more layout for our expense recycler data and remove this constant layout and add card view
and add a layout height wrap content and layout white mass parent for our card view and add app card elevation 5 dp and android elevator android elevation is also 5 dp this will give us a shadow and we need to add margin and we can first we need to copy we can copy all this data course we need same design for our expense recycle the data so we don't need to write all this thing once again so copy and paste it here and we just need to and we can just change our id name so instead of income write here expense so instead of income write here expense and for this id and it's going to be not text expense and for amount is going to be amount text expense so we successfully design our income and expense recycler data item and now open this color folder and create a new color attribute for our expense so we can call it color we can call it expense amount and choose this red color and paste it here and add a color text color and we can call it color expense what was the name the name was color name was color expense so this, this one is expense color what was the name name was expense amount not color so color expense so color expense amount now i think we need to clean this project once again so we successfully design our all this field and add id and i think we need to add layout below type text expense for because we changed this layout id and now clean this project one more time so clean project and now we can see our date our title our note but we can't see our our amount i think uh, we need to check all this thing one second now we can see so our gradle build almost finish okay it will add it not it's not a big issue we will we can solve it later okay now if we can see now we can see our data item so i think that's it for this part we will continue it from our next part thank you